Most people in America are trying to figure out how to make a life worth living in retirement worth having. There's always a player who wants to be smarter than the smartest guy in the room. There's always a hacker who wants to be smarter than the, well, FBI or the military, and that's just not going to happen. If you're that smart, you shouldn't be working in a retail shop. If you're that lame, you shouldn't be doing the game. The bottom line then is like then that you have to make relationships that help you go higher. And there are people that move into small towns to try to take over business development, take over little chambers, and openly all they do is buy, steal, and cheat people out of their lives. In life, we have a moment in time to do the right thing. And sometimes women are so doing the wrong thing that there's a point that they're just going to say, I don't care, I'm not going to bother anymore, I tried my best, and that's not true because God put you to the test, but you didn't listen to God. And when you didn't listen to God, you had a problem. You literally had a serious problem, and you caused the problem for somebody else because you didn't listen and you didn't do things the right way. And the truth is that we have to do things the right way by listening to the Lord in every step of the way. But when you played up on someone and all your pretty furly stuff, you didn't listen to God. Because the guy you played up on was trying to figure out who you were with your new hairdo, with your long legs, and openly he's trying to be loyal to his girl. If you're his girl but he couldn't tell because of the new hairdo and the mask on your face, that's not really on him, that's on you. Because you didn't announce that you were coming, you didn't tell him that you were coming, and hopefully God is pissed off at you. And we're still suffering through COVID. So why don't you get your shit together, bring your boys with you, and get the fuck over here before I shit all over you.